Welcome back everybody to the Johnny Guitar Channel. Today we are playing Fallout 76. And um, I think we're doing conclusions to the pit expeditions. Um, we're here at a White Springs Refuge. And um, yeah, so I've collected a few stamps. Responders headquarters, huh? Um, let's see if we could find... What I want to do is I want to go over some of the things that I earned through the scoreboard by just doing the pit expeditions as well as see what uh, we can purchase from Giuseppe's shop might be some good stuff might Hell not yes, I was born in a barn Ellison. what's your excuse that you made me get no me at all okay let's uh Stopping let's go figure this all out i'm not complaining we could always use an extra hand around here I need to find someone to take the photo for me. Due someone to the me. risk of exploding glassware, mixed drinks so are incredible. no longer I can available. Stare at them forever from afar. Considering all of the places I could have ended up, I'm extremely lucky I'm here. You're very jumpy, aren't you? Uh, perhaps it's nerves. Exclusive to the White Spring, early release bottles of the newest cola sensation, Nuka Cola Quantum. Oh, you think I am a good salesman? <laughs> you should have met my mother. That woman could get you to sell the shirt off your back. Okay, um, so first let's see what uh, Giuseppe is trading. So currently I only have 11 stamps. That's not enough to get anything. Um, I don't have the... I can't craft the auto axe yet, but ever it looks like... Clarksburg? Why would you ever need to go when you've got everything you need? Yeah, okay, Giuseppe, Giuseppe shut curious. up. Shut up, Giuseppe. Anyways, it looks like he's selling some good stuff here for the auto axe. Once I learn that, or uh, once I earn that through the uh, scoreboard. Ooh, Trench Runner's coat, Trench Runner's hood, Tinkerers. So I think these are just Pittsburgh Street Kit. Um, a lot of this looks like camp and or like outfits. That's fine, though. This seems pretty cool. Ooh, Union Stealth Boy. Nice. Okay, so it looks like there's some unique things. Uh, camp items and mods for um, outfits and stuff, I guess. You um, don't look so good, friend. May I interest you in my fine. all-encompassing Fine. Fine, everybody. I'm fine. Let's check out the scoreboard, shall we? Radiation glove box. Oh, okay. So as you can see, just by doing the pit stuff, kind of blasted through a few of these. And I'll get more, um, because remember, I want to go as far as at least I want to get the auto axe. Tra traffic light. I think we're probably by the end of this scoreboard, we're likely to get, our, get halfway through this. Yeah, Pittsburgh Palace. I totally want the Pittsburgh Palace, okay? We gotta get halfway through this City of Steel scoreboard in order to, um, yeah, yeah, make it worth it. Okay, well, um, I just wanted to do, uh, well, actually, let's... Raiders, I want nothing to do with you. Okay, that's fine, buddy. Um, so yeah, overall, I think the pit is a pretty good expansion. I was able to solo it. I didn't, uh, 100% it, of course. But I was able to beat the bosses and solo the entire thing. Um, so that's good to know. You don't need a team. Now, if I wanted to get 100%, you know, and protect all the people, settlers or whatever, um, yeah, I'd probably need a team. Um, but yeah, I did pretty well on my own. Um, and uh, yeah, the pit expansion, it's beautiful. It's very cool looking. I like that there wasn't a time limit, that if I did want to wander about, I could have. 
Um, there's uh, crafting benches and stuff there, but I don't know. It doesn't quite feel like it's a place you could permanently live. But I guess maybe you could, actually. Actually, I wonder if you could just live there. You can sleep there. There's crafting benches. You could, uh, you could farm for junk. There's junk everywhere you can pick up. That's an interesting thought. Could you create a new character, go to the pit, and just... Oh, I don't, I don't think you'd be able to beat anyone. I don't think... Yeah. That would be actually... That would be super difficult to try. In fact, the only reason Johnny Guitar survived the pit was mostly because he can jump and he has a jetpack. Getting up high out of everyone's range was important to survival. Um, but yeah, I think, um, I think I like the pit expansions. Uh... Expeditions, I mean, the expeditions. And I'm going to keep doing them. I'm going to keep doing the pit. I'm going to do it over and over again. Try to get some of those, uh, some of that valuable loot. I'm likely going to do it with teams. Um, thank you for watching the Johnny Guitar channel. Thank you for watching this short series dedicated to the pit expeditions. We will see you next time we play Fallout 76. I bet I could write a whole story about you without you saying a word.